Okay, I'm going to walk you through my version of using Google Assignments, okay? And it's not ideal, slightly more steps on my end, but it seems to eliminate the issues with embedding it from Google Drive. Okay, so I'm going to add um, an assignment, and I'm going to say this is article. Read and answer questions. Now, I have done this a few times, so I'm going to show you here are my directions every time I use an assignment like this. So I'm just going to copy, so control C, bring it over here, control V, all right, and it's the whole set of directions. And it says use the docx file that you'll download. Um, if it's a um, Google slide, it's going to say uh, PPTX um, or the Google Doc link. And if it's a Google slide, that would say slide instead. Okay, and I just change the vocabulary from docx to um, slide or pptx. Simple. I just literally copy and paste it from this previous assignment. Okay, now what I'm going to do is find the file that I want. So I'm going to go to my um, computer and I'm going to navigate to the correct folder. Here we go in articles. So I want to find an article that I used last year in my biology class. And let's say uh, I want the protozoal article. Okay, so I'm going to open that. All right, so there's the docx file. But now what I want to do, and I'm using a testing folder just so I can do it easily. Here's the protozoa article Okay, in my file. I'm going to drag it over into my Google Drive. Now, if you already have it in your Google Drive, you can skip this step. Instead, uh, you would just need to right click on here and download a copy so you would have the docx version of it. Okay, so since it was on my um, computer and not in Google Drive yet, I had to do it that way. All right, so now I'm going to open the Google Drive um, document. And I'm going to open it with Google Docs. So sometimes it may look a little odd at first. Don't be weary of that. Now it's going to pull it into a Google Doc. This is exactly what I want it to look at. And here is um, where I'm going to get the share tool. So I'm going to go to share. Having it private only to me is bad. So now it says change the link to Buffalo Schools, that's my organization. But what I wanna do is scroll down and go to anyone with the link, which means the student doesn't have to be logged into a um, Google Drive within my district. It can be anyone with the link. And I'm going to click copy link and done. And now I'm gonna go back to my assignment, click the link, paste this link in. But do you see this end here where it says view sharing? I'm going to change that to copy, okay? And then I'm going to say Google Doc link must make a copy, all right? And I'm going to attach it, all right? I can do due date like normal, change the category, whatever. I also always disable the comments. This is a weird section for students to make comments. I don't get a lot of notifications about it. So I just want to ignore it, okay? So once I click here, create. All right, here is my assignment. And I'm going to make a follow-up video showing the student end. 